Good morning. Today we're here at Big Lots. We're going to go in, take a look around, see some of the prices, some of the things you guys have asked about, and check the shelves. Let's get to it. It's like checking this back section. This used to be the big buy alert section. We don't see that anymore. They pretty much put price stickers on everything. Um, this post cereal, 12 ounces of the Honey Bunches of Oats, is actually a pretty good deal. $2.99. We've seen that anywhere from $3.49 to $4.19 at some stores. So not too bad on that. And some other cereals here. They got that Dunkin' cereal people were asking about. $2.99 here. I believe that was the same price at Target, but that's probably gone up. Here's something I've never seen before. Jim Beam Coffee. Bourbon flavored ground coffee. 18 of the Keurig cups for $5. <laughs> Let me know down below if you've tried any of the Jim Beam coffee. I know a while back people were having trouble finding jelly, grape jelly. Uh, $2.99 here for the Smucker. It's been a while since I've checked these prices, so we'll have to check the stores. So the last time I was here, somebody was asking if they had the Bob's Red Mill flour. Uh, they did not. However, now, looks like they got it in. It is gluten-free for this one here. Super fine almond flour. I think this is what somebody was looking for. It is $8.50. Not sure what the price should be on this normally. They do have the uh, regular five pound bag of the all purpose Bob's Red Mill flour for $4.79. So that's about, about the same price of what you're going to pay for like gold medal or King Arthur. Actually, even King Arthur and uh, gold medals kind of, some of them have gotten, I think, the five pound bag at Kroger's $5.99 for the King Arthur now. So I don't know. Never tried this before. Well, here's some good deals. They've got some different cereals for $3.50. These are the family size. Family size. We've been seeing these go for like $5 in some of the grocery stores. So $3.50. I mean, what I like about this is most of the products, they put the little stickers on here. So it's like, if you took a picture and they wanted to dispute that, well, it's on the box, so kind of hard to dispute that one. Always have to check these little end caps here. I usually check these first because this is where they'll have like some sales. Uh, grill and beans can for two ninety nine. dollars eh, That's pretty much pretty close to the same everywhere. And if you like dressing up your own baked beans here, this is the way to go. You can add maple syrup to taste kind of like how we do it dollar 19 a can let's see this is best if used by june 20th 2023 so one year on the date on that one I did just notice they have some pink himalayan salt down here we get a lot of comments on this stuff uh here's a five pound bag for 4.99 they got this jug of it here for 5.99 this is five pounds also you just get the nice container there, and if you don't need much, here's the 84 Elements Natural Himalayan Pink Salt for $1.29 a bag. That is one pound. They've got a variety of spices down here. Wow, I haven't seen Kingsford Spice in a long time. Uh, $2.99 for that. That's a garlic and herbs all-purpose seasoning, rustic Tuscan style. That's interesting. They got these Paloma rainbow peppercorns 4.99 for that got some garlic sea salt by the paloma these are well that's 2.99 this is 4.99 so different prices on these but it's always good to see variety look at this weber kicking it chicken seasoning 7.99 and they got the chicago steak seasoning 7.99 for that this is a pretty big uh this is 13 ounces right here so I think Big Lots is discontinuing carrying eggs and milk. Uh, we've been coming here for the last couple few months and they have not had any milk or dairy in this. Seems like a waste of electricity. This is always empty. Looks like they got a couple green giant cans here that were $1.50. Marked down to $1.13 though. Just these two. I wonder what the dates are on them. Maybe they changed them out here. December of 2022, so not long for the Best Buy date on that. That's probably why they did this. They do have their Crystal Geyser Natural Alpine Spring Water back in at a higher price. It was 
uh, it went up to 349 for a while and now it's 399 so yep and uh, this was 299 it had gone away I remember we saw a price for 349 but they didn't have it in so now it's back in 399 so they have their big buy alert here on these stickers, but I'm not seeing any big buys here. So yeah, there's no stickers on here. Uh, pretty much uh, what you see is that most of them don't have stickers on the bags like they usually do. So there's really no way of telling what a lot of this stuff costs. I think it's funny how they always say for a limited time only. This is as long as I can remember for new card members. 15% off your next purchase and receive a reward for every three purchases. So, yeah, it is something, you know, you definitely want to take advantage of the rewards card. You know, you will save a little bit in that. You can scan the QR code right here if you're in the store or online. Check it out, Lou. I found the ginger snaps. Haven't seen any around in a while. I got bags of them here. These are the Stoffers. Not Stoffers, Stoffers. Got the ginger snaps here. Uh, they are $2.19 a bag here. They also have these lemon snaps right here. These actually look pretty good too. Um, and we always get comments on the original Animal Crackers. The Stoffers version, $2.19. So look at this. Now I'm not sure, I can't really remember the size of the box at Kroger's, but I'm pretty sure it's 11 ounces. Uh, the Nilla Wafers Nabisco, $3.29 here at Big Lots. Now, this is $4.99 for one box at Kroger. So, something to keep in mind. Um, pretty sure that's the same size box. We'll have to check. We had gotten a comment about the Chicken in a Biscuit Original Baked Snack Crackers. This is the family size here for $2.79. We saw the regular size at Meyer for $3.39. Somebody uh, left a comment about that, so I wanted to point that out. Found some more Smucker's jams here. These are bigger. Uh, the strawberry jam here is 32 ounces for $4.29. Um, and the Concord grape jelly by Welch's, $2.79 for 30 ounces. Uh, you know, we've tried this Golden Harvest honey. I am not a fan. I don't know. I'm just not. It says raw and unfiltered. Uh, you know, I don't know. I, I got it. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of it. We got the smaller one here, uh, but they're all the same. They're all the same. This is just the cheaper one. Uh, they do have Nutella, and uh, here's something somebody was asking about, the peanut butter powders. Now, this is the, uh, the Fresh Finds version. We got a comment the last time we were here on this. Somebody said it was really good, 85% less fat, uh, no GMO, not genetically modified. Uh, and this is $10. $10 for this. This is 30 ounces. I wonder how much peanut butter that'll make, though. Probably makes a ton. We did get some good comments on the Fresh Finds um, seasonings here. They do have the garlic powder for a dollar. Multiple ones for a dollar. Some of them have gone up to a dollar nineteen, But I will say these are the newer stickers on the ones for a dollar. So I, I pretty much believe that these, the ones that are a dollar, are... So you probably don't have to worry too much about taking a photo on that one, although I would. Uh, and some of the other ones, thyme leaves, um, soul food seasoning, rosemary, those are all $1.19. They do have a variety of oils, not much variety, not like we saw at Meyer the other day. Boy, if you're looking for some uh, different multiple cooking oils, Meyer looks like it's the place to go. Uh, one thing I will say is their canola oil and vegetable oil is not the cheapest. 459 here these are 48 ounces we did see that the vegetable oil at kroger's is 319 for the 48 ounces and i believe 329 for the canola oil we've seen where crisco has uh, shrink flated to 40 ounces and is 599 now 599 that is crazy uh, we will just buy the store brand we usually get kroger this is a little pricey too for big lots brand I mean, they do have some different, you know, cookie, uh, Betty Crocker, you know, some different things. They do got brown sugar. Let's see, $2.29 for this bag of brown sugar. Oh, yeah, that sounds a little much for 30, for two pounds. So, I don't know. They do have some of the powdered sugar and some different things here. Some gluten-free devil's food. I know we're always getting comments 
uh, for me to check out stuff that's gluten free. So every time I see anything, I like to point it out. They still have the cylinder canisters of the Domino Sugar, four pounds for four seventy nine. We've seen where those have gone up a little bit in some stores. The four pound bags of Domino Sugar are only three twenty nine here, three seventy nine at Kroger, and this stevia that we get comments on is only four twenty nine here. Uh, it is only 9.7 ounces, but that stuff's really light. Not too much as far as flower options go. They have the Pillsbury Best, which if you're going to carry one, that's a good one to carry. The all-purpose flower, five pounds for $3.49. Okay, so in case you missed our video of us at Kroger, Kroger this week has the uh, Campbell's Chunky Soups, three for $5.00. Uh, now they're regularly $2.59 a can at Kroger. Regular price here is $2.29. Take advantage of this deal at Kroger. I know we got a lot of Campbell's Chunky fans uh, on the channel here. So take advantage while we can. Some of the Campbell's soups are just getting ridiculous now. These did go up. We saw these were $1.25 saying that this was a good place to get them. Now a lot of the cream of soups are the same price as they are everywhere else. $1.49 some places are even more. Some of them are $1.79, $1.89. Uh, they do have the bigger cans here like Dollar Tree. But again, this is the same thing as Dollar Tree and you're paying $1.29 instead of $1.25. Uh, and the chicken with rice, $1.79, I don't know. We've gotten a lot of good comments on the Bear Creek meals, the gumbo mix, the minestrone, cheddar potato. Uh, these are $3.99 a bag, which somebody had said that they used to be $2.99. Uh, but, you know, everything's going up here. Somebody said the cheddar potato is fantastic. Uh, I try that chicken noodle here at some point. Um, I love gumbo, so I don't know. I might try something like that. I don't know. I don't think Jessica would like that, though. They do have these Swanson broths here, uh, $2.69. They've been $2.99 at Kroger, so a little cheaper here. They're selling these healthy choice cans for $1.69 here. $1.69, $1.25 at Dollar Tree. One good deal is the Campbell's Kitchen Classics. I know somebody on the channel was looking for the country style chicken noodle soup. I haven't been able to find that one, uh, but this is really good right here. $1.29 a can. Uh, we haven't been able to find it anywhere. I, uh, they used to sell it at Dollar Tree. I didn't see it the last time we were there. They do have the Progresso can, some of them for $1.49 a can. Uh, let's see, best of use by date, July 20th, 22. Well, that's yesterday. That ain't good. I wonder if they'd give me this for 50 cents. I wonder if that's why they marked that one down 30 cents because here is a chicken noodle and this doesn't Best if used by November 13th, 2023. So a lot longer on that. Let me check this other one here. Wow, yeah, July 20th, 2022. So, yeah, I don't know about that one. Again, here we are in a big buy alert area. This is, there's no good deals in here. Like, okay, well, maybe this thing of apple cider vinegar for $6.49. We've seen these big things go for like $8, $9 now. Uh, but the Olive Garden seasoning, that's $4.99 everywhere. I mean, uh, I don't know. That might actually be, this is the bigger one. This is 24 ounces for $4.99. But like this Sweet Baby Ray's right here, $2.79. Like it's $2.49 for the regular price at Kroger, but they usually have it on sale, so... Yeah, I don't know. It's it's funny. Some of the most expensive prices of things we're finding in the big buy alerts. And they got the four cans of chicken noodle soup for four dollars. So you would get the camel chicken noodle soup for a dollar a can. I guess that's a decent deal. Um, we got like the Goya red kidney beans, dollar forty nine. That's the same price as it is everywhere. Let's check this one out here. Uh, Best Buy two eighteen twenty six. Okay, so got some years on that one. Somebody was asking about refried beans. Uh, I pointed them out at Dollar Tree the other day. These are $1.39. Uh, the name of Rosa something. Let's see here. Rosarita. Rosarita, $1.39. Let's 
see. Good, good source of fiber. Yeah, no kidding. So they got the 20 ounce thing of Heinz ketchup here uh, for, let's see, $2.29, which, okay, so that's actually a decent deal. The regular price for this at Kroger's is $3.29. Now they've been having some sales. Uh, we never really know when. Let's see, okay. So this was the, uh, the best used by date. Uh, July 17th, 2022. That was four days ago. Four days ago. And one thing I wanted to point out is look at the color of this. That is not bright red like it should be. And I was looking at these other ones. These are real dark red here. I don't know if they were sitting out in the sun, but I wouldn't buy this. I don't care if it was a dollar. It just does not look right. This is probably one of the most expensive places to buy pop also. Uh, $4.99 for these 16.9 six packs. $4.99 for these. These are on sale with a digital coupon at Kroger this week for $2.79. So that's a good deal. $4.99, bad deal. Bumped into another end cap here. Let's see what this is. Three cans of the Campbell's Chunky Classic Chicken Noodle. I was thinking this was the, uh, the home style one. Uh, $4.99, so okay, that's the same price on sale at Kroger this week, but you have to get all three chicken noodle. Got some different cans here. The Polar Wild Caught Chunk White Tuna is a dollar. Um, I don't know. Lemon Pepper Tuna. Plant-based goodness. Oh, okay. So that's a fish, fish free. Sorry, I was out of view there. Fish free. Plant-based goodness. 99 cents. Let's see what the date is on that. November 9th, 2024. So that's got a little ways. Let's see what spaghetti those are. Oh, look at that. Okay. A little bit of a sale here. These have been $1.50 ever. Well, chicken meatballs. We saw this the last time we were here. I have never seen a can that says chicken meatballs except for the ones here. I don't know. What's up with that? Uh, they do have the Cheetos packets here. Let's see. $1.69. Round up to two. So, yeah, not a very good deal. Uh, eight, so it'd be almost eight dollars. It'd be like seven, seven fifty, about seven fifty for four of these. That's a little outrageous because the four packs at Kroger are cheaper than that. Um, yeah, I don't know. Not really finding any good sales. Even the Chef Boyardee is a dollar forty nine a can here. Now the regular price at Kroger is a dollar forty nine a can, but apparently they have a locked in low price. Of these for a dollar 25 with your plus card until september 13th 2022 at kroger so keep that in mind also the other spaghettios are a dollar 29 here uh that's cheaper than pretty much anywhere else we've been seeing them for a dollar 50 pretty much everywhere and somebody had asked uh which was funny because it was in the same video that we were talking about this um the country libby's country sausage gravy Tell you what, you make a little bit of sausage and add that in here, boy, that is a meal. That is pretty good stuff right there. $1.99 a can. Yeah, so I had a feeling when we saw those cans for $1.50 that they were not $1.50. I don't know where they came up with that price. Maybe it was because it was the mixed vegetable one. But, yeah, that's probably what it was. But $1.29 a can here. Um, $1.25 a can at Kroger. But, you know, some of this stuff I can see where you don't want to go to another store. They don't have much variety here though. They've got the peas, the green beans, and the corn. So that's pretty much it. They do have the Libby sliced pineapple. We did get some good comments on this. Um, let's see. Best if used by November 15th, 2024. So we got a little while on that one. Oh look, another big buy alert. Let's see. Let's see what's going on here. They've got this pasta italiana. I don't know. That's the organic. Uh, $2.50 for this. It's only 12 ounces, though. Um, but I don't know. It looks fancy, right? Uh, they do have the Green Giant. Four cans of the cream-style corn for $3.50, making those less than a dollar. That's a pretty decent deal, I guess. Uh, let's see. Ooh, Del Monte. $1.19. Okay, well, it's a little cheaper on the corn than Kroger. It's $1.29 there. Uh, Vienna sausages of the Libby's. Wow, I don't think I've ever tried these. Got the Libby's ones here, 50 cents. Well, that might be a big buy. 
So they've got the Barilla spaghetti for $1.60 a pound for one box, $1.60, $1.59. That's a pretty good deal. We've seen it for $1.80 at Kroger. We've even seen it in some places for $2 a pound, uh, $2.29 for the gluten-free. Um, and we've seen this as high as $2.99. So that's a good deal on that. So pretty empty on them. As a matter of fact, they only have two. Ben's original ready rice, all they have is two of the basmati. Uh, we're seeing these things go out the door, guys. So if you like the Ben's original ready rice, uh, find a good deal on it. That's why we do these shows daily, so that when we find a good deal, you know, we can buy them up when we see them. Uh, Kroger's is selling them for $2.29 right now. As far as pet food goes, they never really have much, but they always have a little. Um, they are out of the Friskies here for $0.69 cents a can, which is cheaper than Kroger. Kroger's Friskies is $0.80 cents a can. Fancy Feast is $0.90 cents a can. They don't have much, but they are still $0.80 cents here. Uh, they do have the Nine Lives, but it's a little pricey. We've seen these a little cheaper than this. Uh, some $1.99, which I think went up to $2.19 at Target. Uh, $2.49 here, so a little more expensive, but at least they have some. Well, they usually have more dog food, but not today. This is it. Actually, yeah, I didn't even see these Purina 1 cans up here. What is this? Six cans for $10.49. Um, let's see. I think these were $2.19 a can at Kroger. So, yeah. A um, little cheaper. Not much. They do have the six cans of the Pedigree here for $8.99. So, you know, they got some dry, but this is it. That's it. Last time we were here, too, somebody had mentioned if I saw the Beach Cliff sardines. I did not. They are here. $1.19 a can. They've got the mustard sauce, Louisiana hot sauce, and the soybean oil. I, think it, I don't think these will. I forget what the one you said, but these aren't ringing a bell. Uh, they do have the Star Kiss tuna for a dollar. Like we've said, all the reasonable stores sell it for a dollar. All the bad quote value dollar stores sell it for dollar 25 dollar 40 which is ridiculous uh they do have the bumblebee solid weight albacore for two dollars we've seen this go from 209 to 219 so a little bit of a better deal here so even though it was the brunswick that we saw at dollar tree it's the same thing it's the same thing i believe bumblebee actually makes the brunswick dollar 99 for this dollar tree dollar 25 and they taste exactly the same Exactly the same, except these are $2. Okay, so somebody a while back said that they were having trouble finding green olives. So this is why we come to stores like this. This is another option. Um, you know, we when me and Jess come here, we're usually shopping for like holiday stuff or a new chair or desk or something like that. That's where you can really save at Big Lots. But these olives here, these queen olives, the uh, fresh finds here, $2.99. These are really good really good i really like these um they've got the little oh those are the same those are just tiny ones but uh yeah if you're looking for olives and you can't find them check big lots you pretty much have to check every sticker here at big lots too because i just found this four pack of the cheetos here for 3.99 now they were selling one of these for 169 so much better deal on that good morning <laughs> I like when they put these prices up here for stuff like this. $17.99, 42 count, 80 count, $24.99. So you know every one of these Victor Allen coffees, which I am not a fan of. Uh, we've gotten a lot of mixed reviews on it, though. I know a, uh, a lot of people do like it. I'm not a fan, um, but that's okay. I have tried a couple different versions. I've tried the Colombian and the Donut Shop. Uh, there is a Donut Shop decaf. There it is right there. Um, this, you know, I finished it off, but it was tough. Found a good deal here. $17.99 for the 30-ounce thing of the Dunkin' ground coffee here. This has been $20 pretty much everywhere, so a little bit of a deal on that. Also, they've got the Cafe Bastello pods for $7.99. That's a pretty decent deal. All right, guys, the secret is out here. Um... They still got their Folgers for $9.99. Uh, take a picture of this. But, um, you know, we saw it was at Meyer for $10.79. Kroger's for $11.79. So, let's see if the Colombian... Yep, Colombian's $9.99. Black Silk, $9.99, which that one's always a little more expensive. 
Check it out, guys. Big lots. If it's not on sale, I haven't seen it on sale this week. So this is the cheapest I've seen it. So the Cafe Bastello. We saw the Cafe El Moro at Dollar Tree. That's the one that's $1.25. And that's 6 ounces. This is the Cafe Bastello. 10 ounces. It is $4.49. But I think people were getting a little confused. I'm. It, this is Puerto Rican coffee also. So it pro probably comes from the same place. Check out some of the oats here. We've been seeing that this has been going up in price. $6.49. $6.49 for the quick oats and the old-fashioned oats, but always look for these stickers. This is on sale for $4.19 for the uh, quick oats. Don't see any sticker on the old-fashioned. Um, does look like they're keeping the regular prices of chips down with some kind of savings that they're able to get because we know Ruffles is normally $5.59. It even says on the bag right here, $5.59. They're selling it for $4.49. Now, we've been seeing Kroger's and Meyer and some other stores do some sales, which that's really what we need to, that's, you know, that's the only way we buy these is if they're dirt cheap. Uh, $5.59 for Doritos now. They got them for $3.99. So, you know, I mean, I, I don't even think I'd pay $4. I usually wait until Kroger's has one of their, buy four, get them each for $1.88 or whatever it was the last time. But, yeah, $5 for a bag of Doritos or this, that's too much. All they have is the reduced fat Ritz crackers for $2.79 a box, though. $3.79 a box, regular price at Kroger. So I wish they had. Now we got them when they were two for six when they had a sale. So I'm saying, you know, we need to buy up the sales as we see them. And then, you know, eventually you'll start to notice that, oh, wow, yeah, I've, I've saved on this receipt. You know, if you do a little bit of research, a little bit of math, we can make it work. So I don't know too much about these prices and what they were before, but I will say that the last time we looked at this, it was near empty. So it's good to see that they're getting some stuff back in. We did not see any Advil. There was one thing of Tylenol the last time we were here. So uh, yeah, it's definitely, definitely good to see they're getting some more over-the-counter medicines in. So somebody was asking about hydrogen peroxide. I thought this was all they had at first. Um, you had said that you haven't been able to find it anywhere. I haven't really been looking, but since it was fresh in the comments there, I wanted to show they've only got one here. Only one. Now, it's a 32-ounce bottle for a dollar, so that's probably why. It's a pretty good deal. Uh, but if you're having trouble, check Big Lots. This is good to see all this stuff, too. We saw that they were out of a lot of their different mixed nuts and stuff the last time, so I'm glad to see they're getting them back in. Uh, here's another good one that's a little pricey, the Spicy Tex-Mix Tex-Mex Trail Mix here. Uh, not that spicy, really. Uh, just enough spice. It is $8.99 for that. Uh, that is 26 ounces, so uh, you do get a good amount. Um, I think I paid $7.99 for that one time. But, you know, they've got a lot of these different dry fruits, sunflower seeds, just all different kinds. And they, they mix in other ones like, you know, your pistachios. These are the no shells, $5.99, um, different almonds, you know, the good stuff. Well, guys, that's all the time I have for Big Lots today. You know, it's a good day. It, I, I love Big Lots, not so much for the groceries and stuff, but for all the other things that they have, all the home decor stuff for birthdays all the toys really good deals on toys we never really go over that stuff maybe once it gets like toward the holidays me and jessica will do a video over here now for some of the stuff we found some good prices like on the cereal and stuff like that it's kind of uh you know always check the expiration dates always fun day though always good to check out our options and uh see what's available in other stores uh you know last year right about this time maybe a little later we were seeing a lot of empty shelves here around the city of Cincinnati. And uh, we've seen, you know, we've seen other things kind of going out the door lately. So I always like to check on all the different options that we have in case we can't find something, you know, in some of the stores that we frequent. Well guys, thank you so much for watching the video today. I hope you enjoyed it. With all that being said, I am out. And always remember the adventure is out there.